All right, hey friends, how's it going? We have such a fun video for you guys today. This is gonna be a math activity and it has to do with our theme of the week, which is insects. And I'm gonna start off by explaining what you need in order to do this activity at home. So the first thing you're gonna need is a ladybug. And you can make a ladybug or you can print one off the computer and make it big so that you can draw on it. The second thing you'll need is a writing utensil. I laminated my ladybug, so I chose to use a dry erase marker. That way I can write on it and just erase it when I'm done. But if you don't have a dry erase marker or a laminator, you can use colored pencils, pens, markers, pencils, whatever works for you. And then the last thing you need, so the third item that you need, is a, is a dice to roll. And preferably one that has the numbers written on it. This is going to be perfect for learning how to recognize numbers. All right, I'm gonna teach you how to play this game and then we'll get started. And if you don't have these materials at home, don't worry about it. You can play along as you watch this video. So to play the game, we take our ladybug and we take our dice. When we roll the dice, whatever number is facing up, we write it right here in this box. Then we count the spots on the ladybug. So if we write the number four up in this box, then we put four spots on our ladybug. All right, so let's get started. So here are all our materials. There they are. You need the dry erase marker, the ladybug, and the dice. So you start by taking the dice, and we'll go ahead and roll it. Ooh, okay, what number is this? So if you are rolling the dice and you see a line like that, that line always goes on the bottom. So when we put it that way, what number is that? Number nine, right guys? So we'll take our dice and then we'll take our ladybug. See this? We'll go ahead and take the lid off of our marker. Okay, here we go. So we got the number nine and there it is right there. So if you don't know how to write the number nine, just look at your dice and write it over here. Now number nine is pretty easy. You can just make a, a round, like a, almost a circle, and then do a straight line down, just like that. Now the next step is to count the spots on the ladybug. So we need nine spots for our ladybug. Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, let's take a look. Do you think we got it correct? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Very, very good. Now, the, the great thing about using a dry erase marker is that you can erase it as soon as you're done and get ready for the next Round. So let me quickly erase these spots and we'll get ready for the next couple. Okay, just like that. And we'll erase our little number nine up here so we can get ready for our next number. Here we go. So we'll take the dice again. Ready? And we'll go ahead and roll it. Oh, we already got a nine, so we'll roll it again. Ooh, I rolled it a little hard that time. Okay, look at the dice. What number is that? Number 11, very good. So we'll take the dice and we'll write a number 11. Now 11 is easy because it's just two ones. So you go one, one, and that is the number 11, one, one. All right, so now we need to count 11 spots for our ladybug. Let's start over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, go over here, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Let's just double check to make sure we got the right number. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Very good. We got eleven. So now we'll erase it all. And get ready for the next one again. My eraser is falling off my marker. We gotta, we'll have to work on that a little bit. 
Okay, almost there. Only three more dots to go. Whoops. There we go. And the number. There we go. Okay, let's do this one more time. So we'll take the dice. Go ahead and roll it. Ooh, this is a good one. Okay. What number is that? That's a number we all know. That is number 10. Very good. If you said 10, very, very good. So we're going to write the number 10 right up here. 10. Remember, a 10 is just a 1, so straight down and a 0, just a circle, 10. All right, here we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now, I think we have 10, but let's, ju let's just count again just to make sure. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 spots on our ladybug. Now, some other things you can do with this is some math equations. So if we have 10 spots on our ladybug, but four get taken away, how many do we have left? So let's go in and we're taking away four spots, which means we have to erase four spots. So we'll go ahead and erase one, two, three, and four. Here we go. Now let's see how many are left. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we don't have ten spots anymore, so we'll erase that. Now what, how many spots do we have? Let's check again. One, two, three, four, five, six. So now we know if we have ten and we take away four, we get six. Now let's take six and let's say the ladybug has six spots now but two get taken away so we'll take away one two how many does she have left one two three four so we don't have six anymore we have four now remember four is easy you go down and over then down some more that is how you make a four so now we have four spots. Now let's say there are four and we take away four. Can you guys guess how many we'll have left? I want you to think about it while I'm erasing our four spots. Think about how many spots will be left. What do you guys see? Are there any spots left? Nope. So four, take away four makes zero. Who remembers how to draw a zero? Just like this, almost exactly like a circle. All right, guys. So that is our video for the day. I hope you enjoyed it. And hopefully you have the materials to make this at home so you can practice. You can practice with your moms and dads, your brothers and sisters, however you want. All right, thanks for watching our video and we will see you all soon.